The Lagos State Environmental Protection Agency has conducted nearly 400 enforcements, cracking down on various environmental violations. General Manager of the agency, Babatunde Ajayi, said this during an advocacy rally against noise pollution. And Esther Mariola reports. Marching through the streets, advocates and volunteers are urging for a quieter environment. Their message is clear. Turn down the volume, limit exposure to noise, and prioritize hearing protection. The negative impact of um, noise is that it causes ear defects, it can make somebody go deaf. So they just need to avoid everything that deals with noise in their environment. For myself, whenever I'm in a place where there's noise, I'll just excuse myself from there and I'll tell my friends who likes making noise to reduce their noise, just allow the noise to be moderate. International Noise Awareness Day 2024. In the meantime, the agency underscores the importance of collective action in promoting a healthier living environment. Every major city globally um, that has a population explosion and population density the size of Lagos will definitely experience a certain level of noise. Now, bearing this in mind, we also we also know that we still must have and preserve our residential areas. We must preserve the noise levels even in our commercial areas. So what we're doing essentially is managing and keeping people mindful of our permissible noise limits across town. Increasing um, the volume of your phone or your you know, headphone you know, can damage your ear and it's irreversible. And also knowing that this can affect your mental health. You know, if you are um, in a very noisy environment, it can affect your mental health, it can increase your, your stress. You know, it can also affect the communication between your teacher and yourself, you know, learning process. So it's important that um, they pay attention and also learn more from everyone around them, learn from the government resource, you know, and continue to take this information back to their various communities because it's one person at a time. You know, if you're able to take the information back home, then you can influence other people um, and, you know, so we can have a better society. Yeah. With ongoing programs and policies aimed at reducing noise pollution and fostering sustainability, the state may be on the path towards a brighter, greener future for all its residents. Esther Mopariola, TVC News.